today it's the KLX cart. It has two things I've been wanting to do for it. I've just kind of been pushing it away, you know, but we're doing it today. And it needs a chain tensioner really bad because the chain just kind of flops everywhere while, while I change gears and stuff. And then steering angle. Nothing's really wrong with it, but I would like more angles so I could get better drifts and just kind of turn around tighter areas. So that's what we're getting done today. But let's go check out the KLX cart real quick. So here she is. And like I was talking about the chain right here, she's, yeah, really needs help on that. So we're going to get that situated. And the steering, she's kind of sad right now, but we'll get that situated also. And after all that's done, I'll be making another video doing a hydraulic e-brake. So I'll be fucking, I mean, freaking ripping it around corners and stuff. I'll be teaching you how to build that and just a whole other video on how to do that stuff. But today we're doing this, so let's get started. So we're going to get started on the chain tensioner first. I'm going to start by cutting out my piece of metal and deciding where I'm going to mount it and all that good stuff. This is the roller I'll be using. It's literally an old skateboard wheel from my Sector 9 board. Just gonna put it under there and just make it work. So let's get started on that. All right, cool. So I just got done with the mount, made a little groove so it fits nicely to the frame, welds nicely also. I made my marking on the frame so I know where to weld this. Now I just need to make a little, like a little axle right here so I could hold the wheel to the mount. And that's about it. I have to grind off a little section of the paint right here so I'm not welding directly to paint. Always remember that. But that's about it. So we'll get started on that and finish it up and move on to the steering. made double progress here this is all painted it's all fastened up looking good and then this the mounts are welded on there I don't have paint which sucks but we're gonna rock and roll anyway just have to bolt that on real quick get some gas in this thing start it up and we'll do a little rip in the driveway so let's get to it and do it once that's all done I'm gonna go freshen up real quick, throw on a fresh t-shirt, and we're gonna let this little thing just do what it does. So let me go do that real quick, and we'll be back in action. Three, two, one. We're back. I got a fresh shirt on, go-karts outside. Susie's out here with me. Diesel's jamming with a dirty rag. Fluffy's jamming too. Iris coming in. Probably about a jam hit them. <laughs> but yeah, before I even got the go-kart on the ground, I noticed a few problems when I started spinning the rear wheels that the chain was gonna keep popping off. So I added this little bracket right there that goes over the wheel and then those two right there that kind of hold that all in place. So now we should be good and ready to party.
I think that everybody should go like and subscribe to this YouTube channel.